guys it's nicole and welcome back to my channel good morning okay it is so freaking early it's currently 4 45 in the morning and you might be like nicole why the heck are you up so early and it's because today we are getting out of a rut so as you guys know or if you didn't i've been like super stressed super unmotivated super overwhelmed and just basically in a rut there's just been a lot of things going on in life right now with college decisions school work I don't know. I've just been struggling a little bit, but I've noticed I've just been like out of my routine. I haven't been working out. My mood throughout the day is just like bleh. So I decided to take this whole day to get out of this rut that I'm in. It's also a Monday, start of a new week, and it's the perfect time to get back into my routine, get back into my good habits, and get back into my good mindsets. So I'm going to show you guys how I'm doing all this and how I get out of a rut. Overall, it's just basically doing the things that make you feel productive, that make you feel your best. So the whole day, I'm just going to try to keep a positive mindset mindset, be productive, do the best that I can, and do all the things that make me feel amazing. So that is why I'm up so early is because we're going to start the day off with the gym. My gym opens at 5 30 so we're going to get up, get ready, do all the steps of my morning routine, and start this day off right. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get out of this world. I'm so grateful because I woke up in such a good mood today. It's also Monday and usually I dread Mondays like I wake up and I'm like nah -uh, today's not gonna be my day but today's the complete opposite. I feel so good and I feel so ready for the gym. Today we're hitting legs. I also want to go to the sauna after my workout too. It just feels so good in there but I'm about to hype myself up even more. I'm just gonna play some music and then we're gonna have a good workout. Sometimes I get questions like do I go to school sweaty after the gym? But no since I start class at 8 30 and then I wake up at 5 It gives me like an hour to get ready and like get clean and not show up to school in like a sweaty mess Let's head home and get ready for school. You guys it's such a pretty day Whenever I walk out of the gym, that's the time that the sun is starting to rise So I can always get like a feel of what kind of day it is and the skies are blue There's barely any clouds, which I love. Loki. It's been like super cold and windy. So whenever the sun's out, I'm like Praise the Lord. Okay, but we're gonna do some makeup and my hair. But you guys, my latest obsession is listening to the Victoria's soundtrack. It's so good. Like, I was like dancing full out in the bathroom just right now. My favorite one is Countdown. Literally listen to it. It's just, it's just so good. I'm just gonna do my natural makeup though. But I wanted to tell you guys about this past weekend because it was really good. And I feel like that contributed or definitely contributed to like my good mood today. And just like the motivation it gave me to like get out of this rut. So last week, super overwhelming, super tired, super stressed. Y'all already know. So Saturday, I I literally dedicated the whole day to what I like to call a bed rot day and that's basically <laughs> you just lay in bed all day and rot um I was looking at college stuff I was watching miraculous I had like a thousand meals and literally just like rotted in bed all day and it was amazing personally I need those a lot especially if I have like a rough and hard week like sometimes I literally just have to block everything out and just stay in bed all day I feel like that totally shows the homebody in me people were partying Saturday night and I was just like in my bed watching miraculous but like 
not complaining. And then on Sunday, which was yesterday, I actually went to a women's retreat with my mom, one of her good friends, and basically my aunt. She's a part of Love Made events, and she puts on these like women self-love, self-care retreats. And now that I'm 18, I can go to them. And like, we honestly just had the best time ever. It was like an eight hour retreat. It was at this really pretty event space. And there were a bunch of workshops and speakers. There was some like movement and like dancing, but I ended up just leaving the retreat just like so not only inspired from like all the speakers that told their story and everything, but just really grateful as well just for everything in my life like march i've had a little bit of a rough time um oh there's a plane yeah, I was saying in March, I just had like a rough time, but whenever I remind myself that like it's all temporary and to look at all the blessings in life, like I just feel so much better. I think I just had like a really refreshing and good weekend that kind of set me up for today, like getting out of my rut. I just, I don't, I don't know. I just feel like so happy today. And like, it's a really good feeling because <laughs> I've shed some tears this month, but like even this morning I woke up in such a good mood. I like sprung out of bed basically. And I was like, yeah, God wants me to have a good day today. <laughs> Countdown to you. Uh, uh, mm, 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 mm. But I wanted to add all that because sometimes you just have to take the time for yourself and do what you gotta do. This weekend I could have went out with friends or like tried to be a social butterfly, which is super fun and like sometimes I do want to do that. But I think I just needed a weekend like to myself just to like reset, get the rest that I needed after such like a hard and rough week. And it was just so beneficial because my mood is just so much better now and I'm getting motivated and inspired again to like get back into my routine and do all the things that like make me happy happy again. So if you ever find yourself in a rut or going through, just going through it, those are the steps that I recommend is like getting the necessary rest or like self-care time for you and getting back to the things that make you feel your best. I'm hoping I can maintain this energy throughout the whole day because sometimes I will say when I do wake up at five to go to the gym, I'm pretty tired like towards the end of the day. But you know, I just feel it. Like I feel like I'm gonna have a good day and like already having that mindset in the morning sets you off on a great foot. So count down to your oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let me finish my makeup and my hair and then I'll show you guys my outfit. Outfit of the day. Whole fit is from White Fox. Love language, a little red tee, and then these low waisted jeans. They're like cargo pants, they're so cute. It gets a little cold in the beginning of the day, so I think I'll just wear this right now. It's also from White Fox and it's just a really comfy hoodie, so. But today is actually a spirit day. We're doing a spirit week for disability awareness and today we're supposed to wear red and I think we're like giving out lollipops during lunch, which is super cute. So yeah, there's the fit. Guys, there is a cuteness overload at the moment. First of all, Saderson. Oh, look at this cute little baby. This morning, so <laughs> you have your little sweater on. <laughs> She's so cute. She's so cute. Why are you so cute though? Like, save some for the rest of us, thing. You're so cute. Huh. Boop. Second cuteness overload. My mom bought a Hello Kitty toaster. <laughs> Look at my bread. It has Hello Kitty on it. It's right there. It's that little pink thing. But every time you toast the bread, it imprints a Hello Kitty. Isn't that so cute? My mom found it on Amazon. It's a big sleigh. Thank you, mommy, for my breakfast. Breakfast time, I have two eggs and some jelly on toast. I'm still leaving like 10 minutes, so I'm just gonna chill and eat. Countdown to your world. You guys, T minus one week until spring break. Freaking finally, bruh. I need a break from school. I think the day that this video is being posted though, it will be my last day before spring break. Bye, love you. Yes, my next few videos, you're gonna get my college decisions video and then also spring break vlog. So stay tuned. It's gonna be a lot of fun and <laughs> interesting content, but I'm so excited for spring break. I give y'all a little hint of who I'm spending it with. And yes, it is Maddie. I'm so excited to see her. I haven't seen her in a little bit. So we're going on a trip together. Well, she's coming with us. It's gonna be so fun, but I've just had it with school lately. <laughs> like me and my friends, the Senioritis is hitting. It's definitely high. It's getting higher. But thankfully, I don't think I have any tests this week because last week I had my last math test. Now we're just doing review. I had an econ test, so we're not gonna have another one this week. And then like AP Lit and ASB, I don't really have tests. Oh, but I am going to work experience today. You guys are gonna see a full day of my schedule today because if you didn't know, Monday is the only day that I have five classes because my work experience class only meets today. So I'll try to vlog in like each period. Mm -hmm. Okay, I just pray for good vibes at school today, good spirits, and that I don't crash because I'm feeling good right now. I don't feel tired yet. See y'all at school. Bye. Three. Okay, so say you lose one solve. Most of the time, you can't solve stuff. Just a little bit. Oh, okay, I think I need to do that. <laughs> the roll and then example. Okay, guys, I literally haven't been vlogging because nothing 
exciting happens in my other classes. But I'm in ASB now. Nicole, to stop me from eating. I'll show you what I have left. Wait, can I show them my tiny mic? Yes. <laughs> Guys, yeah. my oh, sorry. best $8 purchase ever. <laughs> LTD, what do you have today? I have a beautiful sandwich, a turkey know. sandwich for my mom. That I, I stopped her from eating and finishing so that she could show so them. So I have half a sandwich, period. They love the healthy. Trader just popcorn. Healthy girl, healthy girl. And healthy girl healthy for girl spring break, break, guys. Wait, oh. T minus one week. That's so fun. And then I got this. This is my new favorite snack. It's like the roasted teriyaki seaweed. Those are good. Those They're are good. so flavorful. They're good. What do you have? Okay, I have. And then my friend was like, Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I have dumplings. Oh my god. Yum, yum, yum. It looks so good. So I'm gonna eat them all. How was everyone's weekend? Yeah. Wait, when is this being posted? Friday. Oh. <laughs> How's everyone's week going? Me and Sid are wondering. Let me give you guys an update on Lift Up though, which is like the project I'm leading. So the day this is being posted is the day we're filming Lift Up. And I don't think I'm gonna vlog it just because there's so much like going on that day, you know? But it's all going well. Like the planning and everything. It's like sad and exciting because it's yeah. your last project. It is like my ASB. last big project. Even though there's still like little stuff that we do, but it's going well, so. Damn, Yay. look at me dumpling. Do you want some? What's under there? Is that all dumplings? It's all dumplings. I feel like Jordan never comes over here unless like we pull out the food. food. Mm. I thought we went to the gym today. Mm -hmm. I'm going after school. Guys, fun fact, me and Sydney go to the same gym. Stay hydrated. <laughs> Stay Sydney inspires me. Like, look how big her water bottle is. I have like the 40 ounce and she brings this huge jug to school. Like, do I have to pee every hour? Yes. But am I hydrated? Yes. And that's important. That's a tip. To get out of a rut, drink more water. Eat good. Hydrate or dehydrate. Yeah. Do you have any how to get out of a rut A tips? rut. Like, if you guys are like ever stressed or overwhelmed, what's your advice? Like, when you're feeling down that you need to like get back into it for me it's like usually food i'm mm. gonna be honest like mm -hmm. good food and then sometimes a nap mm. sometimes a good nap will like reset me back not so fast to be organized it's like i did this like yesterday first i did like a deep clean of my room yes love it and then i like wrote in my notion i like planned out my whole week because <laughs> me and Sid are actually so smart no because i told them like saturday i like had a bed rot day like i just like didn't Guys, do anything every I month slept. for one like saturday or like friday just do I have a rot day where i just like eat whatever food i want i wash whatever i want yeah. And like, I don't get out of my bed. Care. Don't talk to anyone. Like, just like no. do whatever you want. And it's really beneficial. Are you just like waiting for another dumpling? Thank you. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm -hmm. Look at these two. <laughs> my food thieves. I honestly thought you had like rice at the bottom or something. That's why I was like, stacked so <laughs> no, it's all dumplings. <laughs> I don't know. There's so much sauce though. Look how much sauce my mom has. Kids just slurp it. <laughs> okay. I guess that's all. Bye. We're currently outside tanning. <laughs> When it's a nice day out during ASB, we all just exhibit A. <laughs> okay, um, we're gonna get a little emotional for a second. Ergie goes into ASB and she goes, I was doing some pondering. <laughs> I was lost in thought last night. lost in thought, and you know, when you're lost in thought, it's usually not beneficial. Especially lost in thought as a senior in high school. It's pretty tough out here. She goes, Wait, what did you say? <laughs> I started being like, I don't know how I'm gonna survive without the people that I have in my life right now. And how, like, I'm just supposed to leave. No, like, I don't know how that's going. This is, like, crazy, guys. Like, actually, though. Especially because we're going to really different schools. <laughs> oh, yeah. People were asking if, like, I'm going to the same school as my friends. Not one of them. <laughs> we're all going different places. Different directions. It's like, sad. It's sad. Cross seas. Cross Wait, come, Addie. Cross states, bro. Guys, look what Addie's wearing for the Red Spirit Day. She's wearing Pogba's first. She's always, this Wait, what is the only this? red I have. 2022. Oh, my God. That wasn't last year. Years years ago. Ago. What is this conception of time? Okay. Have you ever... Have any... <laughs> Any I've revelations? Had, I've had a lot of pondering thoughts. Yeah, I'm like, because I know when I think about like leaving you guys, I'll get like hella sad. Oh, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. So I'm, I'm like trying not to think. Yeah, that's what I do too. Right? But like, it's March 25th. We graduate we'll June 12th. Like, yeah. Oh my god. Uh, nuh -uh, nuh -uh. It's really scary. Good luck to all you. Yeah. yeah. For real. Ugh. I have like a lot of regrets. No. Like, things that I that I wish I did last year that could have helped me this year. I relate to that, and I'm like, I wish I tried harder. Like in this class, yeah. whatever. Yeah. But then it's like, like so sad, so bad. Wait, what's yeah. the- Too bad, Too bad, so, so sad. sad. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad, so sad. Like, you can't change the past. Like, you know, just deal with I it. I feel like just, like, thinking like that, it's not gonna, like, help you. No, exactly, yeah. So, basically, senior year, it's really emotional, and... I think it just recently, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Senior year, we tell you every day with frowns. No, wait, this video is how to get out of a rut. <laughs> no, the real thing is, senior year puts you in a rut. Like, whether you like it or not. Yeah, it's, like, bound to happen. But it's what matters how you bounce back. It's, it's how you take every day. It's what you do. Yeah. Let's <laughs> see what the phone says. 
us today. Oh yeah, so Addie will tell you guys her motivational quote for the day. Oh. It's not like the last. <laughs> dream your dreams with open eyes and make them come true. Period, period. Make the dreams come true, you guys. <laughs> okay, it's lunchtime now. The school lunch is not hitting. Lollies. <laughs> lollies. 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 Giving out red lollies. For the spirit day. And sign and tell your friends to sign. Hey, do here's you daily you dose of a cutie. Yeah. Cool. Cutie. Yeah. cutie. <laughs> what is up, chat? It is Jay Busy Band. Here with Arushi. Yeah. Yo. Did you guys miss him? I'm not wearing red. Where is your red? This is the first class we have. So now me and Mac are in work experience. This is our last class of the day on Mondays. We usually dread our Mondays though because we get to stay. It wasn't a bad day though because it was no, sunny. No, it wasn't. It went like when it's sunny, it went by really fine. Fine. But we are doing resumes right now. Is this a final project? No, probably like our last big one because last yeah. semester we only had one. I'm just kidding. That's a joke. Bleep. <laughs> Mackenzie. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay, guys. So we're working. We start taking back. So we're creating our resume right now. Okay, but we stay for like not the full period because our teachers chill. She'll let us out before everyone else gets out so that we beat traffic. So it's really nice. But we just have to work for like 45 minutes. Okay. Peace out. We're gonna work now. Bye. All right, you guys, I am done with school. Today was actually a really good day. I got like all the work that I need to done. I just have like a little homework for math and AP Lit, surprisingly. <laughs> Usually I don't have homework for that class, but it shouldn't take me too long. But right now, I'm actually gonna grab some acai bowls with my friends. Usually it's just me and Mac who get beach bowls because we always end at the same time. But since today we had to stay for fifth period, all of my friends get out at this time too. So we're all gonna meet at beach bowls. I'm so excited because I am obsessed with beach bowls. But it's super important to find a balance with school work and also hanging out with family and friends. So I love when I get to find time. And it doesn't even have to be that long. Like me and the girls, we're just going out for like maybe an hour or two. We're gonna get some yummy food and just like sit and talk. And like I literally love them so much. So so yeah, I think that's another point of getting out of a rut is also like being around the people that give you that happiness. And just like when you're around them, you don't have to worry about stuff. That's how I feel around my friends. Like we can just talk about anything or just like rant about random stuff. And they just make me a happy person, so. <laughs> Look at her, such a cutie. Look at my scrumptious bowl. How is everyone's day? I'm a little hangry right now. <laughs> got a smoothie. Okay, bye, I love you. I got peanut butter chocolate bowl. <laughs> I got a piranha. Sydney has a dirty diamond. Same thing, smoothie. Right I got it with strawberries. <laughs> I got a Caribbean. Now we're gonna talk crap. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, you guys, now it is time to do some work at home. Mom is preparing dinner. Here. Mommy say hi. hi. We're having shabu shabu tonight. It's gonna be so yummy. But first, let's get some work done. So not only do I have a little bit of homework like I told you guys about, but I'm also gonna do some computer work right now for like brands and stuff. The launch, I think I can say it because this video doesn't go out until this Friday. I am doing a prom edit with Beginning Boutique, which is so exciting, and it launches next week. You can see some behind the scenes on my Instagram and my TikTok now, and then I also vlogged like the day of the photo shoot, and I'll be posting that vlog soon on my channel. So it's super exciting. Basically, I picked out a few dresses. It's a collection of 16, just super cute, super pretty dresses, and it's launching very soon. So stay tuned and get ready for prom. So I need to do some videos for that right now, and then also like send out a few emails and stuff. Family, hi. Uh, say hi. Hello. Hello. Look at this scrumptious. Meal. We're eating shabu shabu. Yum 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 yum. Daisy's like no drama. Oh. <gasps> also, guys, last episode of Bachelor comes uh. out tonight, so we're gonna watch that. Even though I like Kelsey better. For Team me, Kelsey. I you think? You think gonna pick Daisy. Okay, but the predictions no are in. Mom thinks Daisy's gonna be the girl. But I wouldn't be mad about Kelsey. Well, I want Kelsey to win, but mm. it's gonna be intense. Bachelor time! We have dad folding some towels over there. And watch Bachelor. And me, mom, and Sadie. Who do you think's gonna win, Sadie? Kelsey! <laughs> it's Kelsey, dude. There's I no way. You. They're so cute. Look at her. She's crying. <laughs> You're crying too. <laughs> yes! I always knew it was gonna be Kelsey. <laughs> Didn't you say earlier it was gonna be Daisy? You know how it is. You just, it's always Kelsey. <laughs> oh, this was a really good season. He's a good bachelor. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy for them. Wow. They had to pay for their wedding at this point. Aw, <laughs> oh, what a good season. Wow. Okay, you guys, it is time for bed. 
Oh my gosh. It's a lot later than I wanted it to be. 11.22 p.m. I didn't know The Bachelor, like the last episode was that long. But we had a great time watching. I also had a really good day today. I definitely feel like I'm out of my rut or just like whatever I was feeling last week. I think I just needed like a busy, full, and productive day like this just to like get me going again. If any of you guys are ever going through a hard time or ever going through a rut, just know that there's always steps you can take to get out of it and get back into your routine. Like I mentioned earlier, get the proper rest that you need and then find all the things that make you happy and make you feel your best. So that is how I get out of a rut. I'm gonna head to bed though because I'm literally so tired and I have to wake up early tomorrow morning to finish editing if you guys stayed till the end of this video comment down below the rose because <laughs> of the bachelor thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed make sure to like and comment down below subscribe to my channel subscribe to the family channel turn on all my post notifications i'll see you guys back with another video i love you guys so much so